Welcome to TDR's version of Mythbusters. In the cannabis industry, there exists a bunch of myths, such as smoking cannabis is as harmful as smoking tobacco, that cannabis use causes long-term memory loss, that it's okay to drive when using cannabis, and that cannabis helps you sleep. On today's episode, we answer that question. What exactly does cannabis do to our sleep? It's a topic that has gained considerable attention lately, given the widespread availability of cannabis products. Whether you call it marijuana, weed, or cannabis, let's get down to the heart of the matter. What does marijuana do to our sleep? Join me as we explore the science behind it. To kick things off, let's explore the potential benefits of THC the psychoactive compound in cannabis on sleep. One of the standout advantages is the decreased sleep onset latency. In simple terms, THC can help you fall asleep faster, which is a blessing for those who struggle with racing thoughts or insomnia. Research indicates that not only does THC assist individuals with insomnia and falling asleep more quickly, but it also extends the duration of their slumber. This improvement in sleep quality leads to a higher daily functioning and overall boosting in well-being. Interestingly, similar positive effects have been observed in people dealing with depression and and post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD. Furthermore, the non-psychoactive component of cannabis, CBD, shows promise in the realms of sleep. CBD may influence your body's thermal regulation, lower core body temperature to initiate sleep, modulate adenosine sensitivity, promoting drowsiness. CBD may also appear to calm the amygdala associated with fear and emotions, potentially allowing for more peaceful sleep. Nevertheless, it's critical to remember that CBD's effectiveness as a sleep aid is still undergoing investigation, and the optimal dosage for sleep remains uncertain. These findings, however, offer hope, particularly for individuals with severe sleep disturbances. Now let's explore the flip side of the coin, the potential downsides of THC when it comes to sleep. Despite its ability to expedite falling asleep, THC seems to compromise the overall quality of your slumber. And typical sleep cycles involve transitions from light to deep sleep and finally to REM rapid eye movement sleep, where dreaming occurs as a process vital for the brain health and cognitive functions. Alas, akin to alcohol, marijuana has detrimental impacts on REM sleep. THC not only postpones the onset of your initial REM stage, but also curtails the total duration of REM sleep. Many cannabis users report experiencing fewer dreams, a phenomenon supported by the studies revealing that reduced REM movement and intensity. Prolonged REM deprivation can result in heightened anxiety, mood swings, and in extreme cases, hallucination and paranoia. If you've ever taken a break from marijuana or tried to quit, you've likely encountered the vivid and frequent dreams that follow, a rebound phase marked by the heightened REM sleep. Sometimes studies suggest that the individual with pre-existing sleep issues might turn into a cannabis as a potential remedy. In summary, the effects of cannabis on sleep, particularly those with THC appear to be a mixed bag. While a single dose may offer temporary relief, sustained use can swiftly worsen the situation, notably disrupting the REM sleep cycles. CBD shows more promise, but more research is needed. For now, I claim this myth plausible as it will depend more on a case-by-case -case situation. I'm generally curious about your experiences and viewpoint on this topic. Please feel free to share your thoughts and comments in the section below. If you'd like to see more videos on this series, hit the subscribe button. This series is all about uncovering those myths and finding out if they're busted, confirmed, or plausible.